we got to go back to going to wrestling school. When I okay. did go to wrestling school, I was there for a, not, like I said, I'm going to be completely honest. I'm going to be completely honest. Uh, when I went there, I've always been really good at picking up women. Because I've always worked in strip clubs. I've always had the gift of gap. All right. So when I went there, dude, all I'm doing is I, uh, I'm hanging out all night in strip clubs. I'm hooking up with chicks and stuff. I get back to my apartment that I had like at one o'clock in the afternoon. I sleep all day. Wrestling school. If I was there three, four months, I might have went to wrestling school three, four times. Maybe. <laughs> The rest of the time, brother, I swear to you, I'm hanging in strip clubs. I'm hanging okay. in so, all right. So I, they, Larry Sharp calls me one day and he goes, hey, you got to come in today. Jerry Lawler wants to take a look at you. Mind you, bro, I know nothing. I think one day I learned how to lock up and that's it. That's all I know about wrestling. <laughs> I've been there three months and I've been in strip clubs the whole time. And so Jerry, I get in the ring with Jerry Lawler, right? And he goes, throw a punch. He goes, throw a kick. He goes, and I, he, he tells me what to do. And he goes, well, I can work with you. So he hires me. Okay, all I know in wrestling, bro, all I know in wrestling is a hit to lock up. And I don't even do that well. And so my very first match ever, not knowing anything about wrestling, not one thing about wrestling. I thought it was a half ass shoot, okay? Uh <laughs> I wrestled Jerry in Memphis, Tennessee on a Monday night, which is big back then. That's excuse me, that's a big thing. I wrestled him on a Monday night, Memphis, Tennessee. I beat him in the middle. One, two, three. I win the, the uh, USWA, or not US, it was the CWA, the Memphis title, heavyweight title, my first match, not knowing anything. 